Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, Rat here from Ratko Tarot and this is going to be a Aries Sun, Aries Moon and Aries Rising weekly Tarot and Lenormand reading for a November 12th to November 18th, 2018. And uh, while I'm shuffling the cards, uh, I want to remind you once again guys that this is just a, a general reading for Aries star sign and it is not your personal reading. Therefore, um, I will do here my best to explain you the meanings of the cards and their synergy in the spread, but it falls to you to make sense of them and to align them to your personal situation. Now, if you want me to do that for you, well, that will be a subject of a personal reading. And for personal readings, please check out my website, which is listed down below in the description of this video. And there you are to find a, a full list of my services as well as their pricings. And also, as the um, Christmas is coming up, uh, coming up uh, here is looming on the horizon, there is a special Christmas sale mm -hmm. that I am doing. Uh, it concerns the 20 minutes uh, service and uh, as soon as you know you purchase your 20 minutes, this also adds up a, a future uh, recorded answer to a question that you may give me anytime you want after the reading takes place so it's kind of like a additional answer that you're gonna get so that being said guys uh, the, we are going through the um, four card spread here and uh, the weekly spread and the first card is about the topic of your Aries this week and that is to be the two of pentacles so the two of pentacles points that first of all you are to have a lot of things to manage throughout the week i mean you can see how the person is juggling with the two pentacles as the pentacle is a, a symbol of stability and security and also a monetary increase it means you know that the topic of this week is that you are to have multiple options available how you are to increase your stability and how you are to increase your comfort zone as well but you need to know with the two of pentacles is that this card rather concerns more about small changes and you should not expect it like this is going to be a, a life turnaround thing but rather like that these are the small and uh, completely conscious changes that one could do in one field of their life or another that is going to make them face what it is to come further down the road much more comfortable and with much more ease. Also the Two of Pentacles asks you kind of throughout this week to go without any specific plan or if you are going down the road with a plan you need to have as well that plan needs to be open-minded in the sense of that you should be able to adapt that plan depending on what it is coming and what it is thrown uh, at you throughout the week because there are because there are to be many surprises out there although a petite ones but still a, a surprises so you need to be rather more playful than stiff when it comes to performance and when it comes to basically a daily routines out there either career or either relationship wise the next card that we do have this is uh, this is the core of the situation or uh, why the two of pentacles is happening and now we do have the king of wands that expresses you and your standpoint here which is giving the expression of the two of pentacles and for what it seems guys throughout uh, this particular week you are to be very confident uh, in yourself in your capabilities and for some reason you will also have a, a very positive attitude towards your undertakings career or relationship wise this card uh, I'm trying to to find the correct English word here to express myself but let's say that throughout this week you are to find a, a huge impulse of ambition within you so that that specific week it's very potent if I may say that way finding a way to make an, an execution of a specific undertaking so um, uh, if you are trying to execute a certain project or to initiate excuse me a certain project then definitely that is to be a week where you are to find many options available how to do so but as long as you are rather more playful than stiff with a certain plan just to give you an example here uh, if this is a, about a, a big investments that you are uh, waiting to happen you know and investors that are coming to you and they are ready to invest in your business you know they may approach you with a, a slightly different conditions 
all right and even if those even those conditions aren't fitting well with your current plan you need to be open-minded enough you know to adapt your plan to those conditions so you can finally get the subsidization here and so on and so on for for one uh, stable and employed career or for one relationship you know you you gotta you rather need to have as i said that positive um, um, positive outlook and ambition to to make the things literally happen and as soon as you kind of have that particular standpoint there are many options available out to be um, uncovered to you now we do have a little bit of a contradictory here in between the two of pentacles and the king of wands the king of wands does not like to change its plan but he will have to all right you will have to although you may find yourself a little bit uncomfortable to do so now the next card here it is about the challenges that are causing predicaments we do have the page of pentacles and uh you know i could uh, interpret this card as a person and should that card be a person then that most likely is a, a younger woman than you are a, a very slow with her performance uh kind of like it's uh, sometimes these people i don't want to sound that way but sometimes these people s seem like they have some sort of a a, 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 a mental burdens all right it's kind of like they have a mental damage over there you just simply can't figure it out or they have no sense of emergency whatsoever and that may start driving you nuts especially if that is a person of your team you're really trying to grasp on this funding as we went with that specific uh, example here you want them to do their job you know so in time so you can be prepared with your presentation here how you are to entrow those uh, investors and they have no and that person has no sense of emergency whatsoever they just don't care you know they do their job although they do they're doing their job well they're doing it way too slow of your liking and that will be a challenge that you need to overcome in any way possible also if that doesn't appear as a person here as this is a general reading and that may not appear as a person for every single one of you Aries then this uh, this uh, plays a role as a uh, the clamorous belief on uh, on that this specific adaptation that you are to make here readaptation with your plan is really gonna bear fruit and uh, you are also going to be a little bit hesitant uh, in regards to how fast this unfoldment is to happen with your readapting with your readaptation of plans and here the page of pentacles points that is gonna happen slower you know than of your liking but in the same time should you go with that specific direction of readapting your plans then uh, they will definitely give uh, give their fruits and they are to be fertile here um, what I'm trying to say is that even if it looks like that you are after trifles at that specific point it they are to appear something uh, quite uh, quite of a big devotions following down the road but it's gonna take a, a little bit of time well it may take more than you have anticipated but the end goal here speaks for itself that is to be quite a um, <clears throat> thriving undertaking and the last card it is pointing to the guidance that you should adopt throughout uh, this um, specific week we do have the four cards so this card speaks for itself you basically gotta be open for everything new as a matter of fact that card as a follow-up especially with the king of wands which is your core here that that is your personality throughout the week it does gives an, an impression that everything can happen i mean every single idea that you do have really can be manifested but it all comes to how much you're willing to invest in it here what people you involve into the idea to work for you because it's very essential that you do have such people because the king of wands he does not work he just points the finger and he lets other people to do the job for him he is like an he is like the idea giver he is the problem solver um, and uh, the 
the solution finder but he does not get his hands dirty and to do so as i said you will need to make certain readaptation here with your plans with with what you give to those people with with the reward system that you have incorporated in etc etc and when it comes to relationship the this card simply these cards simply here points that you have to take the um the steeds in your hands you know and uh, uh, hold your relationship um, hold your relationship tight but in the same time given an impression to your partner that you are giving them as much freedom as possible <clears throat> so they don't feel stifled under the relationship and in the same time consider every idea that they give you as through that idea you are to kind of increase the um, the trust that it happens uh, in between you two because the because the page of pentacles is a challenge the pentacles are about trust this is the core of the foundation when it comes to pentacles and relationship all right and uh, there may be some sort of a uh, trust issues there i mean what you state may not be maybe skeptically faced from uh, or um, taken you know from your partner and you need and you need to go off your road a little bit here so you can prove yourself uh, prove your standpoint to be a uh, worthwhile so that was the uh, tarot reading for you Aries. now let me shuffle the Lenormand cards and let's see what they are to show the Lenormand cards are to show us a uh, event that you should either uh, look forward to here or try to avoid so what we do have is the first one that is the rider. The rider is about news. The rider is, is a about a new direction. Then the next one, this is to be the site. Now the site doesn't have a particular meaning apart from harvesting. <clears throat> and also cuts the next card in reverses its meaning and the next card this is to be the fox now the fox has a, a double side meaning one of the meaning is cunning and trickery the other meaning of the card is work as well so what we do have here is a, a news or a new initiation you know of a uh, if it is a new initiation this is to be a new initiation of harvesting work it's kind of like uh, what we do have over here where you have need to readapt your plans all right so you can proceed further much more productively and this is what happens and then we do have we we, we may have for you a, a news of exposed liar <clears throat> in this week so basically you may find through the informational flow that someone around you is lying, be, is lying, being cunning and is trying to profit on your expenses and obviously you have to basically sub that, you need to render it incapable throughout this particular week but if either, uh, either of these events is going to serve uh, deeply in your favor so I hope that you really look forward to it and you, you capitalize on it as best as you can. So that was your weekly Lenormand Tarot and Lenormand reading, um, Aries says, uh, I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it. And again, uh, this was just a general reading for Aries star sign and it was your, your personal reading. Therefore, I did my best here to explain you the meanings of the cards, their synergy in the spread, but it falls to you at the end to make sense of them and to align them to your personal situation. Now, if you want me to do that for you, well, that is a subject of a personal reading. And for personal readings, you can check out my website listed down below in the description of this video. And there you will find a full list of my services as well as their pricings. Rat signing out now. See you next time. Bye.